So that was what really sold me. It was okay. this idea that communicates over Bluetooth. So okay. there's a question I always love to ask, and I want both of you to answer it, which is how many Bluetooth devices do you think you have in your house? If you just had to guess. All right, Ann, you go first. I'll put you on the spot first. I mean, I would say at least 10, maybe yeah. 20. I don't know. Like everything is Bluetooth I feel like everything connected, has Bluetooth I feel now. like. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. I agree. Mine's probably 20 to 25. Plus your car. Oh. Like there's, yeah, I mean. Yeah, right. Your car. <laughs> That's a good call. Yep. Exactly. How many RFID readers do you have in your house? I, none. <laughs> Negative, probably. I got a lot of RFID chips from all the shows <laughs> I go to, but I don't have any readers. Right. <laughs> exactly. And the analogy I always use is I, I think about like hydrogen fuel cell cars and electric cars. They were okay. both reaching maturity in the same year. Like at CES, they're both showing them off. But to run a car, you need a network. You have to refuel. And so if we wanted to uh, adopt hydrogen fuel cell cars, we'd have to go build a million hydrogen fuel cell pumps. But we already have an electric grid. So to put in electric chargers, you just tap into it and you're good to go. Right. Same thing with Bluetooth yeah. versus RFID. Hmm. We already have a network. Every Bluetooth device in my office, in my home is giving some power to my pixels. And we're getting closer and closer to a true ambient environment. And when I transmit, I can transmit directly to my cell phone. I don't need all the specific hardware. It's the standard Bluetooth right. protocol. Mm -hmm. So the, the key to all of these technologies is the network. And there's mm -hmm. already a crowdsourced network being built. I'm not going to go deep into standards and IEEE and 3GPP because people's eyes glaze over. But there are things coming that will make it easier for our technology to reach mass, mass adoption. And things coming that will give more power to the pixels and get us to a true ambient environment. So you'll just have these tags out in the environment and they'll just work. You won't know why. It'll just transmit data and you'll just get it to the cloud and you'll just get your insights without any additional marginal costs associated with the hardware and the installs.